Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the walkthrough. Okay, I'm not back flipping. So, I'm heading over now. Oh, no, wrong. World, World 5. I don't wonder if it would be faster if I just went to World 6 and then jutted back over to... Eh, it's fine. <laughs> uh, I just want to see here. Those are all crowned except for... I didn't get a certain letter for that one. So, Bowser Jr.'s Boom Bunker. Comma time. Please, please don't be a daredevil. <laughs> please don't be a daredevil for the boss. Oh, it is. I remembered correctly, unfortunately. <laughs> well, here goes like maybe 20 minutes of just one part trying to beat this. And what? what? They're putting me here. What? I can't even start at the boss right away. Well, I hope I get a decent checkpoint before then. <laughs> All right, here we go. And I'm, I'm pretty sure there won't be any sort of life of dealios going on either. You know, like that mushroom on the posts, like before. Oh no, that would be, that would be way too nice. Ah, I twitched. <laughs> That's the thing is that when you're pressing the button. Oh, I actually got it though. Is that when you're pressing the button, you you have a little yeah, there's a little jiggle to your movements. <laughs> so yeah, it's it's difficult to just keep that button super steady like that, especially when you're just trying to keep everything else steady. Yeah, so that's why I tend to miss those little one-up things. Is there's a little little pop in the button, just for kicks. It's like, yeah, I didn't think so. I didn't think so. They wouldn't be that generous. I mean, increasing your life to two, or maybe even six? No, this is a daredevil run. <laughs> um, cannon, 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 cannon. Nothing really to collect or anything like that as a result. This is a. Oh, that's right, this target moves. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, that's, uh, <clears throat> that's a little, little change they did there. <laughs> oh, poopers. Well, I, I believe I do get a checkpoint before the boss, so it's just a matter of getting there again. <laughs> Come on, follow me, follow me. There we go. One, two, three. Get in there. There we go. And fly, fly away. I think I got it that time. It's going to be a little off to the right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the thing about the daredevils also is that regular enemies seem a lot more threatening than they typically are too, because yeah, there's a little, little bit less forgiveness going on here. <laughs> Not that the boomerang bros are all that difficult per se, because it's still in 3D and there's a lot of room to dodge. There's a certain other star though, that's uh, that's a lot, lot harder, like the very, very last of the last of the last daredevils. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Oh yeah, and there's mines that floating around the area too. That's always going to be fun. Actually, you know what? Does this have like a crisscross? Okay, there's actually a safe spot here. If you're always aligned with that row of plat, like that platform there, there's always a surface to stand on. So I could actually fire myself off to the side and just land. It doesn't really matter about the one up or anything like that. It's just a matter of getting myself to safety as the prankster combat has changed things. <laughs> uh, I'll just leave you behind. You're doing okay over there. Uh, oh shoot, this is the tilty. Oh, I remember this. This, is, I mean, it, everything is one hit kill anyway, but th the thing about it is that this is really, really menacing feeling. <laughs> All right, there we go. Um, I guess there's a one up if you want to get it over here, but more importantly, I think there's this over here that you probably want to get. Uh, oops, I want to go. Yeah, whoop. That's not good. Well, as long as I make to th make to the boss. I oh shoot, that. Ah, I got the checkpoint. Yeah, well, I don't know what this material is, but it's like it dissolves Mario. <laughs> sure glad I got that checkpoint though. But yeah, I just was not really conserving my cloud flower all that well due to my showing of things. Not that I need lives or anything like that, but... Oh, then again I might, otherwise I'll have to replay the level if I 
should fail at the Doomsday Machine a whole load of times. Ooh, I got all the star bits. Alright. Daredevil. Death. Doomsday. Machine. Optimize. <laughs> my dad's gonna get angry if I let you get another grand star. Time to bring out my Boomsday Machine. I'll just relax in my comfy cockpit and watch you go boom, and you probably will, like 30 times. And I'm also gonna have to do that poison area before the boss each time I die too, I do believe. So that's, that's gonna be, that's gonna be something. <laughs> so now obviously, it's not just, oh shoot, it's not just about the, uh, um, not just about getting up there, it's about not taking a hit either. So that, that could very well be an issue, especially when getting off the top and you kind of end up in the line of fire of the fire bars sometimes. Yeah, so I'm going to be doing this as conservatively as I possibly can think of. Um, let's see here. Let's, let's do the good spot there. Get up there. Get up there. Just, oh, you're, you're electrified. I cannot get up there while you're... Yeah, if you're zappy zapping, I'll just get hit if I land on you that way. I've, I've lost Daredevil comments doing that before. Oh jeez, don't land where the fire bars are. Okay. So the first two faces somehow went decently. Oh boy. <laughs> this is the last hit. And it's gonna go horrendously. I can feel it in my bones. Probably, maybe. But maybe that's good that I'm feeling that way, I, that, I, that I'm not putting a lot of pressure on myself. <laughs> uh, going up, I think, is he's, yeah, he stopped with the, uh, <laughs> the, the fan attack. There you go. Uh, I'm just gonna go around to the next cloud flower location. There we go. Back to up here. Oh, shoot. Well, that's not bad, actually. Whoa, whoa what, what's going on here? What's going on here? Oh! <laughs> did it. First try. <laughs> the stage gave me more trouble than the boss. <laughs> oh, I love when that happens. You're, you're anticipating horrendousness that'll happen, and then it all goes so well. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> That's a star. That may go down in history. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Woo! Now that we went back to other planets and st well, galaxies and stuff to clear out stuff and stuff that was waiting for us, now we can go over to something new. Something blue. Something borrowed. Uh, how about this? <laughs> I think I'm gonna save my favorite galaxy for last last, like before the actual... Well... Hmm. Uh. Yeah, I'll, I'll do this. Do this one here. <laughs> this this place. It's called Throwback Galaxy. Return of the Womp King. Could it be the same Womp King from Super Mario 64? Could it be Womp's Fortress from Super Mario 64? Yes and yes. <laughs> this place actually is. A perfect idea for a, a whole... It even got remix music too, by the way. But this is a perfect idea for the whole uh, galaxy theme planet thing. Because this place was indeed floating into the sky. Like all the other planets in the game and stuff like that. And look at us! We're Ouija! Hey, how's it going? You gonna activate a cannon? Hey you, guy with the stash! Came along just in time! Will you do me a favor get that star back from the Womp King at the top of this hill? Okay, so no cannon for me, huh? Well, there is piranha plants in the exact same location they were, but they, you know, they got a little, little bit more aggressive. They're not sleeping like they were in Super Mario 64, but that's okay. We, we've got other stuff to check out here, too, so we don't, we don't have time to be sneaking up on them anyway. Look at this in place of the, um... This was the, where the red coin star, I believe, was located in the original game. And, you know, oh shoot, that was not the way that I wanted to jump that. Well, it might turn out okay. Just as long as I don't get myself in too much trouble speed-wise. 
yeah, look at that. Woo! I showed you how to do that like a pro. I don't even got all the star bits. <laughs> so yeah, the Super Mario 64 player will feel right at home here. You can even shortcut up here with your back flip like you would usually do. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm actually going to try and explore a whole... That was the bonus planet over there that you see in the distance, by the way. I'm going to explore the whole shebang around these places just for kicks, because why not? I mean, yeah, I could just run all the way up to the top, but what, what fun is that when you're playing something something remixed like this? you got to see what has changed and whatnot. <laughs> <laughs> so, all star bits up here now. Oh man, excitement. Can I get up here from down here? Yes, I can. And what's on top? It's a one up room. Oh yeah, baby. And now, this time, rather than jumping up to it from below, I'm walking down to it from above. Even these duders are here, but you know, in their newly graphically enhanced forms with many more polygons. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I totally missed you. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. And there is indeed a secret where you would find, say, a star or a cannon or something like that in the original. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, so... Basically, anything that's that was there before, like there was a star up there once before. Remember that? Remember that in the original Super Mario 64? Well, now there's a comet medal. How do you get that comet medal? Well, well, let's. Well, huh? <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you after I chat with the bomb. There's like, oh, you look sort of familiar, Stash Man. How you doing? Really pretty star landing here recently, but the big bully at the top of this hill took it. Oh man! Oh man! Oh, it's notes! It's notes! Gotta get those notes! Gotta get those notes! It's the underground theme, Noty Remix. Get out of my way! Get out of my way! Get it! Stop it! <laughs> oh, 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 oh! Nailed it! Yeah. Okay. So how to get that comet medal there? Well, you can triple jump. And then, oh, I was too close to it. Well, that that's one way to do it, but you can also do this, and that that's a classic way to get something in Super Mario 64. But there's also, yeah, you could jump down from it from above. I mean, jump down to it from above because there's a little bit of, a, yeah, you, like you, you jump up from the top and do a spin to get under here. But I just thought I would show the classic way of actually getting that star speed run style. Or I should say, the Comet Metal speedrun style. Okie mm, dokie. I wonder, though, if there's gonna be like something that I can break over at that sharp corner thingy. Like, remember that sharp corner thingy that contained the star as well? Um, that was... Oh, it's broken! Ah, oh, it's gone! <laughs> I forgot they did that, that's right. It's already pre-broken ahead of time. Yeah, this thing is... Oh, shoot, that's not what I wanted to do. But yeah, that, that thing right there normally is super sharp, and it's also got, like, this little edge in the original game that you could actually break if you shot into it using the cannon. It's really, really obscure for a star location, but... It's 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 findable, I guess, because it's got that hinty edge of the textures, or, or say the lines not quite matching up. And we got a newly shiny bolt put into the middle of this. You could still get coins around the perimeter of this thing, sure, but I don't think there's as many coins this time around, though. And there's there's the spot that you could jump down to and spin to get that comet medal, but we already got that. Wiggler, Wah! you're going down. And post, you're going up. <laughs> and there's indeed a one up just like the original. <laughs> hmm, let's see what else there is to show here. Oh, 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 well, there's you. There's you. This is a really scary guy. Oh, they even used the uh, N64 bob sound effects. You're the really scary guy at the top of this hill. I know I can count on you and your fantastic stash. Please take back that star. I will. I will. Uh, you're, you're, you're normally a womp. What is this craziness? Like, you, 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 oops. you should not be here. You should be in womp for, you should be in womp form. Have the womps evolved? And I, I cannot kill this guy for the life of me, can I? <laughs> Let's just not risk it any any further here and just keep our comet metal. Just head on up here. 
there we go. We can get a checkpoint and everything if we die with our one health. And it, this guy is still... Well, it, it's, not, it's not really who you think it is. So I'm just gonna... Well, I, oh yeah, I gotta be more towards the center in this game compared to the original. You can also scooch under them by just, yeah, by just going under their legs by, uh, you know, doing this thing. So they're, they're, they're a very low-threatening enemy, despite them actually being a one-hit kill thing. But yeah, just, well, <laughs> I just want you to flop over and then just... I, I need to ground pound your back here really quick. Just, just really quick. I, I want to just crack your back, if you don't mind. Good boy, there we go. And you're done. Yeah, the Womp King has been destroyed? Hmm. Maybe. Yeah, let's see. Whoa, 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 whoa! Mm. Okay, I can confirm that was not the Womp King. This is the Womp King! And his dialogue is gonna sound familiar. It makes me so mad! We build your houses, your castles, we pave your roads, and still you walk all over us! Do you ever say thank you? No! Well, you're not going to wipe your feet on me! I think I'll crush you just for fun! You have a problem with that? Just try to ground pound the Womp King! Ha! <laughs> uh, oh, he's going down, but it's, he's so big, it's actually kind of tricky to get on top of him to do that. <laughs> and then he goes around, he is not happy. We have Wimps, spelled W-H-I-M-P, and he also does earthquakes, which stun you. And yeah, though those Wimps, they're pretty fragile, despite how they look. They just kind of, they break you just, yeah, I mean, knock them over. <laughs> oh, I almost got squished with there. That's okay, though. See, watch this, watch this, watch this. Yeah, oh, 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 oh. well, okay, whatever. <laughs> you, you can crush your own buddies. That's okay with me. Are you, are you, what did you do that for? And I, oh, and I should have jumped because that earthquake stunned you for a bit. Oh, I nailed it. No, oh, crushed again. I'm gonna have to use cement filler. I'm just a stepping stone after all. I won't gravel. Er, gravel. Okay, you win. Here, take this with you. Mm. Yes, dang it. <laughs> Victory! And I didn't even have to use the little coin spots on the ground, I guess, which I probably should have done, but I just kept seizing the opportunities, I guess. <laughs> Oh, and I was just thinking, if, I don't think it's spinning that takes care of the wimps. It's when they try and attack you by toppling over. I think they break themselves, if I recall correctly. Plus, you know, the Womp King's Earthquake takes care of them. Woo! Well, that was fun. <laughs> yeah! Oh, man, ghosts. So spooky, yet so helpful. Uh, we can now advance, but do we want to? Oh, yo, what are you doing bringing hazardous materials aboard? It's the 164 bob -omb. You just better make sure you stay as calm. I don't want an angry bob -omb on this ship. Eh, he should be fine. The red bob -omb are the nice ones. Hey, bro, I'm all... <laughs> Copy pasta. <laughs> Alright, red bob -omb. I think that was over here? Maybe? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not really sure this time. We'll find them, though. Oh, yes. We will find them. Oh, there we go. Have you heard of this mythical, legendary world? It sounds like an amazing place, but I wonder how you get there. Who knows? Who knows? Just like, who knows if I'll do another star this part? Who knows? Actually, I think I probably will. Uh, <laughs> let's see here. But I think I can... Yeah... I think I can. I, I don't think it'll go be that long or anything like that. It's not a very large galaxy or, or whatnot, so... Silver Stars and the Womp's Fortress taking place of red coins! <laughs> so yeah, Silver Stars must be collected on top of clouds, on top of thwomps. They're not really in any sort of difficult positions. Oh yeah, there's now clouds around the place here as well to change things up even further. Hey, how's it going? Hey, Stash Man, thanks to you, this place is peaceful again. I scattered some silver stars around here for you. Go ahead and grab them. Why did you scatter them rather than just give them to me as a gift so that we can 
I don't, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I don't need to really show that bonus area again, do I? I don't think so. So I'm just gonna go ahead and flip-flop over here to the new set of clouds. Just gonna kind of work my way from the ground up, I suppose, because I already showed you the daily. Wait, actually, isn't there something now that you can find here? Uh, I just want to see here. Uh, I guess not. I thought there was something else there, but I'm no, nope, nope, definitely not. <laughs> um, oh, I don't, ha uh, I don't. Do I have the power of the cloud somewhere nearby? It was a star on the top of that cloud. What? Don't look at me like that. I didn't put it there. Yeah, I know who put it there. <laughs> oh, this is this is here too. Oh man. <laughs> now I feel obligated to replay this song just because I'm here. That Goomba. That he, he doesn't even know what he's attacking at this point. I, sw I swear. <laughs> Hiccup, excuse me. Okay, so we don't have a cloud flower, but we need one to get that star, so I guess that was a bad idea to go there first. That's okay, though. We will prevail in the end, I assure you. Isn't not here, it's the other one. Uh, whoa! <laughs> Oh, there's a silver... I mean, here's, here's a cloud that'll lead me to Silver Star. Uh, but wasn't there something on top of you? Uh, I guess there wasn't. <laughs> okay, so... That, this is actually on the other side of that spot that we've seen. Uh, from, you know, the, the watery area that I couldn't actually get to safely. So this time... I can just do this. And I don't really know if it's really worth... Oh shoot, that's not that's not good. I don't know if it's really worth getting those coins over there. Because you're gonna end up in slide mode on that sort of surface. So yeah, let's just, let's just call it a day with those. <laughs> and we're back here. <laughs> so we, we've only got two. Maybe this will take longer than I expected. <laughs> and wait a second, I'm gonna lose my cloud. I'm gonna cheese this a little bit and go up here. How do you like those apples? Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, there's, there's more than one way to get around here when you have the power of the flower. Uh, oh, I didn't even need to use a cloud to get across that. Cool. Okay, <laughs> star bits. Always lovely. Oh, I'm off, I'm off track. <laughs> That's okay. Can I break that? Yes, I can. Of course I can. Um, I like how there's even arrows on the walls. They're like the original too, by the way. Let's see here. Is there a silver star up here? Maybe, maybe not. I know there's one up on top of the... Yeah, up over there, but that's... that's well, I guess I can sneak over there really quick, because I can go over the top. And there we go. <laughs> Still looking for one, though. Watch it be inside the cage. Of doom! Maybe, maybe. Actually, let's go in the first person view. Uh, that's not, I'm not really seeing anything high up. Uh, hmm, where is that last one? Where are thou, Silver Star? <laughs> hmm. Okay, let's just go around. Uh, maybe I'll have hints from you there huh 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 looking for a silver star i think i saw it at the top of the hill i just got that one i think <laughs> all right you you do your thing actually maybe i should try killing you this time maybe you'll maybe you'll spit out a silver star nah i didn't think so <laughs> see we got the nice flippy platforms here if you're kind of a signature mario 64 thing you don't really see them otherwise in other sorts of games uh, well, maybe there were a couple, but at the time, it was definitely Mario 64 that they had those sorts of things. It seemed like, unless I'm wrong, I don't know every game after all, it's just, just what I remember. <laughs> uh, how about I go and take a Pixie down here? Uh, no, 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 Silver Star down here. <laughs> Okay, so what am I missing around these parts? I went around the whole place. Maybe it's maybe it's snuck inside a crate. Nah, nah. See this? Oh, by the way, this is the sort of surface that you would, yeah, you'd end up getting slid off of and whatnot. You know, I'm taking another gander in first-person view here. Black holes now inhabit the place. That's that, that explains bottomless pits of this place all too well if you think about it. Uh, hold on a sec. 
Nah, there's nothing in the tree. No such owl in the tree. <laughs> I think you know what I'm referring to. Uh, there is one thing that I don't think that I searched for. I mean, searched through was down here. Uh, there might be... Oops, oh, there is something down. That could be a dicey. Let's see if we can get it, though. Yeah, I gotta, I got, I'm shaking my hand vigorously here. I don't want to miss my opportunity to get a cloud going. Oh, the star is all the way at the top. Uh, oh, I got it, I got this, yes. Safe. Oh, the music is gone. What? What? What is this blasphemy? Oh, come on. You really have to do this to me? <laughs> Just because I made a star appear, you've got to get rid of the music. Disappointing. <laughs> Alright, I got that star. That galaxy is complete. <sighs> and unless there's more dialogue, I will be ending off the part. <laughs> 99 stars, baby. Yeah. Yep, no additional dialogue, I guess. So with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part till we get some more stars somewhere.